So hey everybody, uh, welcome back to The Bouncer. Uh, with me today I have... It's me, Jordan. Hello. Hello. Uh, my buddy Jordan Kai here. Uh, so we're gonna be trying the first mode for a bit, and uh, it's gonna be uh, a little crazy here, because we're, uh, we're gonna be uh, seeing uh, who can beat famous character John Arbuckle in The Bouncer. It's a little headcanon thing, you know? Mm -hmm. But, uh, you know, it's what we like, because we're real stands of uh, media in general. Okay. I mean, I don't know if I, I don't know if I'd consider myself a bouncer stand, but a Garfield stand, I definitely. Aren't there more characters than this? Uh, well, I think you have to load them first. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's just, just the data, right? Yeah, it will just freak the fuck out if you don't do that. So I don't know that much about the bouncer, but I know there's four playable. Characters. All right. Yeah. So you do know there's okay. context oh, wow, sensitive shit. Uh huh. Uh, okay. And uh, each character has special moves that are just like pressing L1 and then an additional button like okay. that. Uh, you can also just combine buttons. Now, the main trio, they're out. We know they cannot defeat John Arbuckle. Yeah, definitely not. <laughs> However, oh, yes. we can have. White Darragum fight John Arbuckle, hmm. or Shaded Darragum. Oh, is this like in, in the uh, PlayStation fighting game where you had good and evil coal? Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, what was it again? Street Fighter X Tekken Rights? Or, uh... What? Oh, no, PlayStation No, All PlayStation Stars, All-Stars, yeah. yeah. What's the difference between these two? Uh, so I think this is just Darragon in various states of undress. Oh, oh, there's a lot of them, wow. Yeah. <laughs> That's great. Alright, so uh, I get to pick a kid not here. Uh, I don't pick this thing. I don't know why it wants me to pick the computer. Oh, uh, that's weird. Oh, actually, I know why, because he uh, accidentally set the computer up. Uh, well, you know, that gives us more time to, like, see new characters. I guess so, yeah. So this is a bonus episode, so it's a bit of a mess, and apparently we only have the bar fake, though. Oh, uh, that's weird. Maybe yeah. we'll unlock more as we're playing. Yeah. I hope so. I mean, we gotta see all the beautiful stages in the bouncer. Yeah. Well, are these stages from the story mode, or are they specifically for the verse? I think they're stages from the story mode, but I won't know because uh, Fight. I okay. I have not like played this before. All right. So, uh, so far, I'm sensing a thing here. Yeah. This feels like Power Stone, but bad. <laughs> yeah, this is, I was thinking that a little bit. I, uh, all of Kitna's moves I'm doing have, like, a startup of, like, a hundred minutes. Like, look at this. Yeah, all my moves so, okay. are really slow as well. Hold on, I'm gonna press square now. Alright. Look at that! Look at that! Wow. <laughs> that was, like, three seconds. <laughs> how do you, uh, block and how do you sprint? Uh, These are important. You block with R1. Okay, R1. And you only can sprint if you're not, like, near oh, enough yeah, to okay. enemy. Oh, yeah, okay, yeah, now I see. Alright. Hold on. Oh, Here's my slap. <laughs> got him. That's one of my special moves. So I was getting ready to do an attack, mm -hmm. and the other guy had enough time to turn around and hit me in my wind-up enemy. Yeah. So I think Wong... Probably couldn't beat John Arbuckle because John Arbuckle is, is fast. It's, it's, it's true. Fast, quick on the money. I mean, like whenever he sees Garfield, he does the line. Yeah. yeah, he gets there quick. You know, he's ready to admonish Garfield. It, it's different. It's different. It's difficult to put it in numbers because it's a comic, so you can't tell how long something takes. Yeah. But in that in the first comic, when he uh, tr is trying to find his pipe, and then Garfield has it. Mm -hmm. That's a split second. He knows That's it true. immediately. I mean, where can my pipe be, Garfield? It's like that. Yeah. Okay. So that's. Like kind of my problem in general with how Jim Davis portrays the comic, you know, of okay. Garfield. Yeah, yeah. Oh my god, we have to do three rounds of this at no. the minimum. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, you know, it's kind of like it's kind of inconsistent and in what like John Arbuckle's power level is. Yeah. What was that move? What I just did a move where I stepped on someone. I take look at that. What the hell is that? <laughs> Uh, take oh, that's this cool ruffian. Move. I like this move. What? Oh, well, now if I get hit out of it, then it's not as So, yeah, 
Echidna, you know, she's got flashy moves. Yeah, oh, I'm sorry. But Garfield's, you know, he's like no style, all substance. Absolutely. And his character is uh, all style, no substance. Yeah, Garfield's, uh, Garfield's all business, for mm -hmm. sure. Mm -hmm. And that's the thing. If this Echidna cannot even beat Garfield, what chance does she have against the owner of Garfield? Right, yeah. It's like, it, it's, it, Garfield goes by anime rules, you know? The higher you are up on the ranking, mm -hmm. the better you are fighting. Oh my god, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh boy, that's gonna show up bad <laughs> in the recording. Oh, it's not that bad, actually. Uh, yeah, in case uh, I delete that, that was uh, Jordan's uh, controller just vibrating, even though he was dead like three minutes ago. Oh well, I didn't die that early this All time. Alright, so I think we've played enough of these characters. Yeah, I think so too. Oh, oh wait, it's exiting the boss main <laughs> exiting the first boss. Why did they make that? Oh, yeah, that's good. <laughs> it's like they keep making, like there as well, when they said, do you really want to quit? They made no green. Like, they really want you to stay, make it more tantalizing. Yeah. All right, so this time, uh, let me set it up so it's, uh, we don't have to deal with the computer. Oh, no. Okay, and just one run to win. Yeah, now because I'm going to look forever. even worse. Oh my god, I have to load it every uh. fucking time. <laughs> cool. This is cool. Good games, man. So, Jordan, what are your experiences with the bouncer? Uh, I've seen, like, the intro cutscene, and I watched the first two episodes of the Let's Play while I was on the bus. Uh, or on the train. Uh, and that's oh, what I did. Well, I'm glad you did some research. I'm yeah. like most of my co commentators. <laughs> I wanted to do more. I wanted to try to watch all of it on the train, but then I started getting sick. <laughs> I can't look at a screen while I'm in a moving vehicle. Alright. My friend, it's time to face the ultimate Daragon. Oh yeah? Is this his super form? Yeah. Okay. It's where he rips up his shirt and is like, oh, I'll fight you all. Oh yeah, that's how you know he's Mimi's business. Yeah. Oh shoot. But don't worry. Ready? He's still got the overalls, and <laughs> they're yeah. still there. <laughs> this is a good blocking animation. Alright, let's do this. Alright, yeah. So, uh... Oh my god, Capoeira. Yeah, I'm thinking uh, Ultimate Darigon here. He's yeah. got a pretty lean chance, also because he seems to have, like, twice as much health as you. Oh yeah? I didn't really notice. Oh. Look at how big my health bar is compared to yours. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. I thought you just meant, like, based on how much damage I'm taking, but I think you might be right. Mm -hmm. Wow, that's kind of weird. Like, you know, it's pretty common for fighting games to have, like, to give different characters different amounts of health, but not to actually have the health bar be big. That's kind of weird. Well, it's also because this is the final boss. Oh, yeah. And why would they balance that for this first one yeah. that was probably made in, like, ten minutes? I mean, yeah, I, I you know... It's actually one thing I really like, like versus modes in games that were clearly not made for versus modes. Like, have you ever played uh, the versus mode in, um, dang, in, uh, what's it called, uh, Zone of the Enders 2? Uh, no, I have not played okay. any Zone of the Enders. Alright, well, it's really funny, because it's not balanced for a competitive play at all. So the most powerful character is actually Vic Viper from <laughs> hey, Radius. Cool. Because he can turn into his little Gradius ship, and then he's mm -hmm. really fast, and this shoots a lot of bullets. Okay. So, quick thing. Yeah. Do we think either of our characters can beat John Arbuckle? Uh, okay, so what I noticed about my character is that she has a lot of attacks uh, with really long range, like sliding yeah. attacks and stuff like that. Uh, which I think will be really effective against John Arbuckle, because he is a very stationary fighter. You know, he waits for That's his opponents true. to come to him. But remember, remember one thing. Yeah. His legs are powerful. Garfield once tied his legs together above his hands, and all John Arbuckle had to say instead of admit defeat was, Mr. Funny Guy, eh? Oh yeah, you're right, that's a good point. So like, you know, I think if John Arbuckle gets hit in the legs, he can survive that, he can take that. Okay, that's true. Now, Ultimate Darragon, on the other hand, now I think he's strong. He's yeah. got like the stanky leg attack mm -hmm. that I did. Um, I think he can at least beat Garfield, you know? Okay, definitely, yeah. Like, Garfield wouldn't know how to block, but I feel John Arbuckle is a master at blocking. Like, he lives the stanky life. 
he understands how to block like right. the stanky leg. Absolutely. And I think even though Dar like this version of Dargon had a really large health bar, I still feel John Arbuckle still has more oh, yeah. stamina. Because you know, Dargon. like John Arbuckle, like we're kind of like assuming a little bit here, you know, making up a little bit of a head cannon. Mm -hmm. But John Arbuckle, he can pull out the raging demon and defeat Dargon in an instant. <laughs> All right. So, uh... Hmm. PD4. Alright, you're picking PD4? Yeah. It's time for me to pick the other robot, then. Oh, wow. Which you wouldn't know, having only seen two episodes of the last play. Yeah, I'm sorry. I, yeah. I mean, I would've guessed look at yeah, it. I mean, That's a robot. Like, right there. Yeah. Back at it again at the bar. Oh, this character's trash. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, what? What? Oh my god, this is cool. Okay, I'm thinking we might have a character who can defeat John oh, Arbuckle. Yeah. What, what does that do? I think it might be an anti air or something. Now lean back. Lean back. Yeah, I guess so, but... Oh, there we go. Alright, we got... Yeah. This guy's Ghost Rider. I like it. Yeah, he's got, like, the long hands. Yeah, yeah. Long hand drag. Alright, that's just a lame kick. That's not very interesting. So, uh, one problem with this first mode is also that the context-sensitive buttons make it incredibly hard to, like, find out what moves correlate to what. Yeah. No, yeah, no kidding. I mean, at least the specials always seem to do that. Oh my god. At least the specials always seem to do what they're meant to- What? <laughs> it looked like he just stopped animating when she like fell out of the sky. What? What? Uh, oh my god. Oh my oh, god! What? Holy shit! That was wild. Oh no. Oh my god. I ragdolled a little bit there. <laughs> no! Wait, am I still alive? Oh, Winner. dang. Dominique Cross. I think this teenage girl can beat John Arbuckle. Oh, uh, yeah, absolutely. Johnny, John Arbuckle's. So, like, she's got the air moves, you know? Mm -hmm. And John Arbuckle, his legs are strong. Yeah. But I don't think he looks up a lot. I don't Have think you ever seen him look up? I was about to say, I don't think he's ever looked up. That's true. Like, yeah. he looks down, because that's where Garfield is. That is, yeah. Uh, like,. Garfield can fly. And when you're at the top of the food chain, you don't have to look up. Yeah. What do you think of PD4? PD4? I don't know. He has the long range moves, um, and he has the anti air. And as we know, John Arbuckle known for his aerial assault. Yeah. That's uh, so true. that would be pretty strong. Um, but I think his normals aren't that great. So once John Arbuckle gets in there once he does his rush down, I think it's over. So it depends yeah. on PD4 strategy. I think he has the potential to be John Arbuckle. Mm. I don't think it's a guarantee. Yeah, and like he's a robot of course, so yeah. he has no like deviation of strategy. So I think mm, that's like your point. he already loses the battle mentally. Yeah, absolutely. Right, which we get to are you picking? Oh, I, this is the same character, huh? <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, I like this guy. I like his attitude. Yeah. So what does the S next to all their names mean? Does that mean you have uh, all their stuff unlocked? Or? That's, yeah, that's basically like, uh, that's the high level. I have, I have no idea how to unlock other stages. Mm. I thought just playing it would make them unlock, <laughs> yeah, but I, I guess not. Because, hmm. uh, I beat the fucking game, you think that would be enough? Yeah. Oh, well. Uh, where am I going? Let's see what we got. It's okay. I think this is a grab. Tryouts, uh... Try it like some of your uh, L moves because I think you have one where you spin in and holy shit! Oh my god! <laughs> Alright, let's see. Uh, these L moves are not very impressive, are not impressing me at the moment. Oops! <laughs> I don't, okay, hold on, let me let me hit you with this one first. Yeah. Um. <laughs> Alright. Oh, okay, there oh my we go. Alright. It's like a faint. And I think this one's a grab. Oh, not that one. Whoa. Goodbye. Oh, shoot. So, Magetsu uses none of these moves in the story mode. Oh, yeah? Yeah. 
That's a shame because these are some cool moves. Man. I have at least never seen him use them in like uh, the 19 playthroughs or whatever <laughs> I've had. Oh yeah. I'm pretty sure this is like just one of those Grandpa World War II stories now about how many Nazis I <laughs> he's killed. The more I talk about it, the long the more I've played like the monster to completion. Well, you know how like every uh, Jack Kirby World War II story ended with him killing two Nazis. Every like video game story you tell ends with you beating the bouncer two times. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at that. Look at that lying down animation. That's a good one. Why? Okay. So, that attack, right? First I attack you in the front, and then I turn around to kick. Well, why? How would that ever hit? I don't know. <laughs> That's so bad. God, I love the startup on that fucking move that is like misses half the time. <laughs> Alright. So do you think either of them are Getsus? Uh, defeat John mine definitely... Well, no, because... Okay, so mine has like the, the mind trick moves where he falls down, he, yeah. he pretends he's done, but then he comes back up. Mm -hmm. John Arbuckle would see through that every time. Yeah, like, John Arbuckle, rather than seeking romance, has enlightened himself in the martial arts, you mm -hmm. know? So, uh, I do think you're right. I do think the fates won't work on him. Yeah. Now, uh, my ninja tricks, um, John Arbuckle, huge Naruto fan, he would Absolutely. see through them yeah. in absolutely half a second. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So, okay, he uh... Knows every move. Uh, okay, so we have this girl left. We have Caldea left, and I guess, like... I think just that one. Yeah, just, yeah. like, this, uh, Duragon. Okay. Wait, how's that possible when there's one spot for Rand and then it's an unequal... Oh, okay, no, there's three characters that we didn't play, so yeah, yeah, it works out. I wonder where we're going on this. Thing. I well, like that. It doesn't even pretend that it's gonna shuffle through some random <laughs> stages. It says you pick random, you go to the bar. That's it. I mean, it's Sunday night. Where else can where you else go? Where else are we gonna go? Okay, so this Darugal is powerful because he took up his jacket, but yeah. he hasn't taken up his shirt yet. <laughs> That's a really good outfit. He looks like a five-year-old. Okay, so I'm wondering, Kaldia is like the woman who turns into a panzer. Like, can you actually do that? Oh, uh, let's try. Oh, here we go. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Holy I like shit. This. Woo! Oh, this controls terribly. Oh, I'm on this bizarre let me try. axis. Let me like, try. Like, you have to oh, run around in, yeah. in a huge circle. <laughs> this is cool. <laughs> That's not the word I would use. Look at that. Okay, so that's just the move. Cool. Yeah. Alright, there's All right. your controller. So yeah, let me quickly, like, really, like, make it clear for the audience. This is the tightest circle I can move in. Like, I'm just ro straight rotating the stick. Oh, well, it doesn't work when I'm in close range, I guess. Hmm. <laughs> okay, so also, the panther form cannot block. Oh my god, <laughs> I did know that. I think I'm gonna leave that behind Cool. For now. That explains that why I could just constantly do that in the story mode yeah. without, like... Oh my god. That was a real Tekken 7 moment right there, where we just, like, both missed. I don't know, I feel Tekken 7 that would be a lot more exciting. Yeah, I guess, yeah, because it would slow it down and all that. It would be really cool. We would look cool while missing our moves. Oh, no, I did I pushed the wrong button! Oh! Oh, I thought I was gonna toss you off no, the stage. No, so that's the shitty thing. Actually, yeah. follow me for a second. Yeah, yeah. He can't go down the stairs here. Oh my god. Just put down his side, and I'm so mad. Yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, these people might be evil and, like, fighting each other illegally, but they are still law-abiding citizens when that's it comes true. to a private sp space. Oh my god. That's neat. <laughs> So there's no, uh, there's no, like, area interaction in this, right? Like, we can't do anything no. with those chairs? Nope. No, no. They're just there to be an obstacle. Right. So, okay. Those were the final characters. Yeah. So, um, we've already talked about Darakon cannot be John Arbor. No, no, and no, no matter form. what form yeah. he is in. He can turn into a demon. He can turn into, like, an actual dragon. Like, his name suggests... You yeah. know what? That's actually a problem with this game. His name is literally Dragon. It doesn't transform into a dragon. What the heck is up with that? Yeah. What were you smoking? That's that's messed up. Yeah. But Caldea. 
Uh, okay, so I think it's really obvious that she can't beat John Arbuckle. All right. Because her her big technique is she turns into a panther, it's a feline species. John Arbuckle has so much experience in overpowering a cat. It's true. Yeah. It is true. So, I guess... I guess the only thing that can beat John Arbuckle is a 15-year-old girl. Yeah. Goodbye.